Now, like most of you, when I woke up this morning, first thing I did, I opened Twitter and I saw Sketch getting stretched, big black kukumas running around in Sketch's face, Sketch in a thong, Sketch in a custom, people accusing of Sketch having a sketchy past. It was truly traumatizing seeing those photos of Sketch. I could not believe my eyes and I did not believe it. The second I saw it, it just ruined my fucking morning. I was like, Twitter, show me some titties in the morning. Don't show me sketch in doggy style. I saw that and I was like, okay, there's no way this is real. I did a little bit of investigation. This person released a video about sketch saying sketch the untold story of Jamie Marr. That's his real name. It is sketch in a way claiming that this is his OF account. This was his past before he got popular. They live in the same location. It went through it for a good two to three minutes explaining the situation. And the pictures were truly disturbing. And I don't know if I'm allowed to show you this, but fuck it. This was a video I actually saw on Twitter myself of him guying a black cucumba. Mohammed Boder commented, Brother! These were some of the pictures that were released claiming that this is sketch. And when I first saw these photos, I was like, okay, this can easily be AI. There's something called a doppelganger. It fucking exists. And then people were pointing out the dot in the middle of his forehead. And he also has that same thing sketch. I was like, okay, this is really doesn't prove anything. You can easily Photoshop it. People pointing out a dot on his forearm and then him having the same one at the same place still doesn't really verify every anything another thing people pointed out as well was his glasses being the same style with the same color that is when i started questioning everything asking myself does the double ganger actually exist or sketch had a sketchy past where he used to get stretched still i realized that okay ai is too advanced right now People can easily make. I can literally put a picture of me with Mr. Beast doing a 69. And unfortunately, the internet is like my mom believing that my sickness was caused by my phone. People believe anything they see without even verifying it. And that's when the whole thing started going viral. Everyone started talking about it. Even the streamers went on a rant of saying that it doesn't matter if you actually did it or not. I'm friends with them. I love them either way. Some were saying, no, gay, very gay, things like that. Honestly, when I first saw these pictures, I did not believe it, like I said, but it changed my whole view on Sketch. I couldn't look at him the same way. I just knew that every time I'm going to be looking at Sketch coming up on my Twitter, um, the, the pictures will not leave my mind. It is going to be forever stored there, and I, w I just won't be able to look at him the same way. This whole video I wanted to talk in the first place it was about the allegations and how not true it is, double gangers, AI, nothing really verifies it. But at the same time, in the back of my head, I was like, okay, if so Sketch is being accused of uh, uh, choking on black cucumbas back in the day before he got popular, and people are framing him into this situation and just ruining his image, he should 100% come out as soon as possible and just say... No gay, no choking. I, I haven't done any of these things. And I was hoping he doesn't doctor to suspect his way out of it, saying no crime was committed, no illegal stuff happened. I was on a five minute refresh on his all social, all notifications on, waiting for his response. And I was, it started to, I got curious, why isn't he responding to all these allegations? That is, again, when I started going 50 50 in the situation, but I didn't want to assume anything. I was waiting for him just to come out with a response. Did he? Nope. But who did come out? FaZe Banks. Because Sketch is in FaZe and FaZe Banks decided to make a comment, a tweet, to be more specific, saying he posted it 29 minutes ago. It has already 1.1 million views. Showing the picture of Sketch leaving the premises of the FaZe house after this whole thing was leaked. Leaving his glasses and sneakers and released a screenshot of a text between him and Sketch. Are you ready for this? Are you ready to get your mind fucking blown? Bank said you'll awake, sketch said, I'm sorry, bro. I didn't mean to involve y'all. Meaning, I don't mean to involve you all in this drama. Bro, what do you mean? You're our boy. You didn't have to dip. You didn't involve us in anything, bro. You good? I'm over by the airport. I didn't know what to do. I am so sorry. Scared. Come back. You're good, dude. The boys pulled up on me, woke me up. They wanted to make sure that you were good. You're good, bro. Come back. We're all here. You're the homie. I'll come now. I'll just need someone to talk to. We're all posted. Come back. You need to call. You need me to call your car. 
on the way now when i first read these texts my jaw was on the floor i was fucking shocked my ears i swear to god they were ringing i could not believe my eyes that everything that i've seen because i have seen some shit about sketch i went full into detective mode and i've seen things that you would never in a million years want to see things that when you look at sketch you will not believe that this thing it's actually him. You will think it's a doppelganger or it's 100% AI someone here to ruin his reputation. And I'm 100% sure most of the people who actually saw the videos that I've seen, not the pictures, but the videos, will not be able to sleep at night. That shit is going to be stuck in my head for a very, very long time. And it's very surprising to me. I, I was fucking shocked that someone like Sketch used to do gay corn on his OF? I'm not gonna lie to you, it was even more shocking. My jaw was even lower than when I found out that Dr. Disrespect actually messaged a minor and had an inappropriate conversation. But at the same time, we're not gonna get into his past. It was his past. He changed, but at the same time, it is shocking. You can't look at him the same way. It's not something you'd be like, oh, okay, cool. Anyways, no, you can't. And I I always say this as well, like try not to know your personal, your favorite YouTubers or content creators, personal life or celebrity, whatever. You might find things you will not like. And 2024 has taught us that, yes, it is indeed true that you will probably find things you won't like. And it's not actually for everyone. Like if you actually find out about my personal things, I'm going to say it from now. I have two shameful th sins. You will not find anything from me. My first shameful sin is I used to do TikTok dances. I didn't actually do dances, but I used to do TikTok memes. And my second shameful sin is when I was 18, 19, I was a huge simp lost in the sauce. Do anything to get laid. So in the future, if you find a picture of me and Mr. B69 in Kush exposed for uh, giving gagas to Mr. Beast for $5 million, just know it's AI. It is not true. And I've, I'm being... Uh, people someone is trying to shit on my whole reputation now going back to sketch situation this absolutely dropped a nuke a double triple nuke on his reputation and there's going to be a lot of people who are not wanting to support him anymore because of his past by the same time he tried to bury it by the same time he still did it and if you've been around the channel i always say i have nothing against whoever a guy wants to give gaga to another guy cool do you but i only have a problem with someone influencing it on the younger generation or just being out there guys i suck dick Woo! yeah I, that's that's when i come and i will take a big fat ju juicy shit on you and out of everyone i've talked about on this channel more than 250 videos this has to be the wildest thing i've ever talked about i Genuinely do not know how I feel about it. Like I said, it was his past, but he still did it. He didn't influence it on people, but he was getting slapped with black swords. It's like, okay, going forward, he is definitely not going to be respected the same way with these things. Like, personally, I cannot see Sketch as the innocent, wholesome guy anymore. Every time I see Sketch, I'm going to see that video of him giving gagas. I'm sorry, but this is just how it's going to be. Do I believe he needs to be canceled for this? No. This is just a humiliating thing for him that he did in the past. That was his sketchy past. Now, we all know how he got his username, but I just hope he doesn't actually does do anything stupid going forward while the way he's being treated because I'm 100% sure that let's okay let's say his friends his content creators the face clan they're all going to still treat him the same way but in the back of their head he is not going to be the same guy the way you know the way he was respected before and i'm 100 sure the majority of the internet is just going to pour at him laugh at him make a meme out of him and never let this slide first of all he's losing any beef he gets into because people are going to be talking about it and at the same time like i said it's not something small just to look past even if you try to forget it it's still going to be stored in the back of your memory locked and the key is going to be in your butthole now i hope he doesn't actually do anything stupid with his life this is some serious things i hope the boys are talking to him i hope that they're comforting him saying things will be okay and not just watching him 24 7 
just make sure that he doesn't actually do anything stupid. Like I said, this has a huge impact on his mental stuff as well. Like if he came out gay, yeah, sure, fine. But for him, his videos to be leaked online, that's definitely going to have a huge damage. Fucking nuke his reputation and nuke his head as well because of everyone on the internet making fun of him like again like i said i hope he doesn't do anything stupid this was absolutely wild i literally jumped up on my seat when i found out that this is actually true let's see what the future brings and let's see how the internet is going to take this news because it is still very very new anyways just wanted to share my thoughts on this let me know your thoughts in the comments below as well fuck man yeah take care of yourself i'll see you at the next one